Here's how the malware we've called Locky works. Traditionally, you receive an email from a colleague or possibly someone you don't know, in this case, Chris Harris, who demands payment for an invoice. We click on the Word document, open it with Microsoft Word, and expect to see an invoice. Unfortunately, the document looks blank. Being curious people, we click the Enable Content button. Unfortunately, the document still remains blank, so giving up, we close the email and return to our desktop. Unfortunately, having returned to the desktop with the email closed, very soon a warning appears that states that our laptop has been encrypted by the Locky malware. All of our information is now locked up in a way that we can see if we try and open it, all of our file names have been changed, and if we attempt to open a file, the file looks essentially like gibberish. Again, it's a fully encrypted file, and it uh, isn't something we can access without a key. Luckily, the inventors of Locky have made it convenient for us to purchase a key from them. Following the instructions on the screen, we click to open a browser, and within the browser, they conveniently provide a number of opportunities where we can pay with Bitcoin to various addresses. These days, about half a Bitcoin is worth about $200, so it's not cheap to unlock the laptop, but it's a lot cheaper than trying to deal with uh, recreating all of those files.